What's up, drivers? Happy 4th to you. I hope you guys got some of that 4th of July money. I seen it lit up the night before the 4th and the night on the 4th. Okay? Now, the night before the 4th, I didn't... I ain't even get out, man. I got out, all right. I got out and I went dancing. It was it was time I had to get out, man. I had to release. I had to feel good. I had to um tap into my dancing chakras and get out there and groove. You know what I'm saying? That's what keeps a smile on my face also. Peace out to my um house music dancers, you know what I'm saying? I had a great time that night. Speaking of smiling, somebody knew me in the club that night and they told me how they recognized me was from my teeth. Smile up, baby. What? Listen, what happened to Sunday? On Sundays, if I'm working, which I try my best not to. I like to get my rides in, my money before Sunday, all right? But sometimes things happen, so I end up working Sunday, all good. But what I have experienced on Sunday is Sunday mornings, it is busy. It's prime and surge around 5 to about 9, 10 o'clock. Now, I witnessed this a bunch of times. I experienced this a bunch of times. The reason why I think it's busy that morning because most of the drivers set, um, most of the drivers after the club, 3 a.m., 4 a.m., they go home. You still got people that need rides Sunday morning. You got your Walker Sheamus. You got your drivers that left their car at the club. Um, you still have workers in the morning. I feel the biggest reason is, is just not enough drivers out there. Most of the drivers are asleep. Before the drivers get up from working all Saturday night, you can get that money. And the driver's probably going to get up around 10 to 12 o'clock, you know? And then they probably get back out at one. Another thing Sunday I have experienced is the outskirts. I love when I get a ride to the outskirts, man. Definitely on Sunday mornings and evenings. It's just busy enough where you probably end up taking like a five minute break between each ride. And most of them are long rides. So I know that Sundays, outskirts is going, man. Which brings me to the night shift. What I've experienced on Sunday. Night. Smell up. I have experienced Sunday nights is airport pickups. All right? Airport pickups is serious, man. I start keeping my eye on that airport around eight or nine o'clock. I know you. I know you. I know you drivers be out there get getting that airport money Sunday night. You think I don't know about that? I'm there, baby. What? As I'm doing rides on Sunday nights, I keep my eye on the airport because once that thing starts surging, man. Um. Once that thing starts surging. I creep my way over there. I use the filter to creep my way over there. Or if I'm maybe 15 minutes away, 20 minutes away, I'm shooting there, man. I'm Because that thing will surge for more than an hour, okay? I don't know about your cities, but I know in Atlanta, it surges for, for a few hours, man. And it can turn on and off. When I go Sunday and work that airport and I get there, and I get there and the surge stop, I wait for that surge. I don't even cut on. I sit in that, I sit in the airport lot until that surge turn back on because I know it's going surge or prime again, all right? I know the surge and prime seem to fade away sometime after 12 a.m. Let it be raining or, or delays or some type of storm coming through on Sunday night at the airport. Big money, I'm there. What? Don't sleep on Sunday. I'm not saying don't go to church. I'm not saying don't do your meditations. Don't let it interfere with your life. But don't sleep on Sunday. What happened to Sunday? I'm there, you there, because the money's out there. Smile up.
love. That's why we out there. Be safe. What? Stay tuned to Terry Tips. <laughs>